There's been an election. Didn't go very well. Hello and welcome to this week's episode of Jay and Katie's How To's. Now, if you're in Britain right now, you'll realise that there was an election. We've ended up with a hung parliament, which means... Jay, what are you doing? Pretending to see that lift thing. Did it look like I was on a lift? Yeah, it actually did, yeah. Basically, we've really scuppered ourselves. So this week, we're teaching you how to talk to your idiot Tory parents after the election. Boo! Okay. Uh, just thinking about your mum, sorry. Lots of us will have a set of very liberal politics, and our parents, not so much. Uh, 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 and, um... God, literally, Katie, your mum is so boring. No, oh. Okay, well, we're talking about... Uh, She's probably in there making a salad, isn't she? We had to come outside to make this video. You might not know which way your parents voted. You oh, your mum definitely voted Tory. No, That's she... how boring she well, is. Well, I don't know. I haven't asked her. They wear blue. That's their colour. Do you know what blue is? Blue is like a sad colour. Sad old boring colour. Okay, so it's about more than colours and fashion. It's mm -hmm. about policies and beliefs. You know, Tories like old stuff and, you know, the past. Oh, they like tea. Oh, like yeah. Katie's mum. Tea. Yeah, so Wet tea. It's also about how they think our money should be spent. Or... Your mum never gave me pocket money when I was growing up. Well, I was like, you... can I have some pocket money, Katie's mum? You've given it to Katie. And she was like, no, I'm going to invest it offshore. They might want um, money spent on education in a different way. Oh my God, would... every time I stayed at your house and we'd have school the next day, your mum would give me breakfast, but she wouldn't make me lunch. She'd give me some shitty bit of cereal, a bit of bran flakes, and she'd be like, no, no, not having lunch, you naughty child. You had school dinners. They might have certain views on fox hunting, whether we should chase those cute little animals. Yeah, do you know what happened the other day, right? I had a fox family in my garden, right, at, at home. Uh, it was really sweet. They had, like, little puppies and stuff. And <gasps> Katie's mum came to visit me once to have some boring tea. And do you know what she did? She stole the foxes, and then the next day, I'm not kidding, she was wearing an orange scarf. Not a fur one. Orange scarf. They might think about creative ways that um, we can pay for our pensions. You know, it's an ageing population, and they might have ideas about where pensions should go and how we save money She's for never it. paid for my pension. The thing is, now we're in a situation where it has happened, the country is going to have to pick itself up, but more importantly you're going to have to maintain your relationship with your parents. Um, so how do you do that, Jay? How are you going to carry on talking to oh, your parents I'm after I'm never going to speak to your mum again. 